Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. To myself. What a wonderful Today's video is going to be a project use it up update and this is going to be the last update for the winter so I will transition into my spring project use it up at the end of February where I'll give you an update on all the products right here and then probably introduce some new ones for springtime because currently it is still very cold here in Houston which is like something I never thought I would say in February but it is still really cold here in Houston and so I am still feeling the winter fuels with all my wintry scents. So I have a few that um, I'm going to keep in because I'm still feeling winter. Um, and I'm not going to start with the spring stuff until next time. So look out for that video either at the end of February or the beginning of March. I do have a ski trip coming up near the end of February. So it might be, not be the end of February. It might be March like 1st or around that time. So just keep a lookout for that. But I will go ahead and start with all the empties that I have, which is actually only two. So not too many, but um, I do have hot cocoa and cream, which is a hand cream empty. This scent is amazing. I love it so much. I think I'm definitely gonna get it in at least the hand cream and the mini every season to use because I just really enjoyed it. So that one's really good. And then the other empty that I have is the Onyx Bathhouse Stay Toasty Toasted Marshmallow Body Scrub. Completely finished. Very happy about that. Um, you might say that there's some left, but that's inaccurate. <laughs> but anyways, um, this scent was like not the best. Honestly, it just smelled like sugar. But this formula is amazing and I love it. So those are the only two empties that I have. Let's go ahead and get into um, things that I have updates on. So I'll just start with those hand creams. So I have the Mary Cookie hand cream, which I am currently using, and it's pretty much almost done. I probably will finish it up in the next couple of weeks, um, but this is my one that I have in my work bag. And then I do have Sweet Whiskey hand cream, which is also, they're pretty much the exact same on usage. This one's in my purse right now. So this one will probably be finished up um, in the next couple of months, I mean not months, next couple of weeks. Um, I am gonna put in another hand cream right now and that is Love, which is Cotton Candy Champagne. Actually already have been using it um, at my nightstand. It is so yummy. It's a beautiful cotton candy berry scent. So I've been using this like pretty much every single night to put on my hands. So I will be putting this one in. It's brand new and I'm gonna try and finish it. Another thing that's like honestly about to be finished is the Coconut Mint Drop Body Cream. I've already cut it open. You can see though, there's still a lot in there. Um, definitely cut open your body care products if you're not doing that already because there's so much left inside when you cut them open. But this one, um, apparently I was at 5.7 ounces the last time I used it, but I totally used this up so much in the last month and I've been loving it. This scent is honestly so good. It's probably gonna be finished in the next two days, um, but really, really good scent and I'm going to replace it already. I'm gonna replace it with Christmas cookies and this one I have used like just a little bit. I'll go ahead and mark it like at the top, but um, I do wanna have a body cream going right now because it's pretty cold here, like I said. My skin's getting dry and I just wanna have something that's like very moisturizing to be able to use at night. So I will be putting in uh, Christmas cookies. Here is where I put the line, pretty much right here, it feels like. Um, and the scent notes are creamy cookie dough, almond biscotti, and caramel woods. So this one is such a good scent, but it is from 2020, so I don't want it to go bad. So I'm definitely gonna like try and finish this up as fast as I did the other one. So I can get this out of my collection because I don't want to be holding on to these things, these body creams for longer than a year. So gonna try and finish this one up. The next thing I have an update on is the Victoria's Secret Tees Heartbreaker Perfume Rollerball and I did make a quite a bit of progress. So let me go ahead and mark it. So as you can see, I only have about this much left and that's about how much I use each month. So this will probably be gone in the next month and I will have to put in a new perfume, but I'm pretty happy about that because I am trying to reduce the size of my perfume collection. So very happy about that. And I've been absolutely loving this perfume. Let's move into some body lotions. I did have the strawberry pound cake body lotion in here. I have it upside down because there's honestly not that much left. Um, 
I did use it a bit. I was right here before and now I'm down here, but I honestly have not been using body lotion at all since it's been so cold here recently. So I assume I'll use this up like in two or three weeks once it's warmer here, um, but not right now, but I'm gonna keep it in because I've, I've got such little left that I can just finish it up really quickly. So that's good. And then the only other body lotion I have in the project is the Peppermint Essential Oil um, Aromatherapy body lotion, which I've actually just been keeping beside my hand soap at the sink and I've not made any progress on it. So <laughs> there's the mark from last, uh, last update. I probably used it like two times. So I need to get better about using this one. Um, especially after I wash my hands because it just makes sense. So I will get better about this, but I honestly think that I'll just leave it at my, um, next to my hand soaps in my uh, bathroom and just continue to use it like that. I'm not really like trying to use it up very quickly. So I'm just leaving this there and what I use, I use. Okay, the last kind of moisturizer is the Winterberry Wonder Body Butter. This is also from 2020, so it's getting a little older. Um, but I've been using this a lot since it's been cold, so I did get quite a bit of progress on it. Um, I think I was right about like here before, so you can see I've used it a little bit more. We're probably like a third of the way through. So if I continue to use it like I have been, then it'll probably get used up before the end of the winter project. So I'm really excited about that. Okay, let's move into some shower gels. So I have white pumpkin and chai upside down because I started it out. Um, let me go ahead. Well, I should have turned it upside down, but here's where it started last time, last update right here. And now we're probably down to right about here. I'll go ahead and mark it right now, but it's pretty much almost used up. Uh, I'll, I give it another week and it'll be finished. So I'm very happy about having this one almost done. And I'm, I've been really enjoying it, honestly, even though it's a fall scent, I've been really enjoying it. One that I haven't gotten a lot of use out of though is Winter Candy Apple. Here's the line from last time. I haven't gotten a lot of use out of it because I've really been focusing on white pumpkin and chai, but I will go ahead and mark it and I will keep working on this. Um, I don't know yet if I'm going to leave it in for the spring project, but I probably will get a lot of use out of it once I finish the white pumpkin and chai. So at least that, but yeah, just been do doing this one every now and then, not a lot. Another thing that I haven't really been using a lot is the Strawberry Pound Cake Moisturizing Body Wash. Um, I have the line from last time right about here. I would say I'm right about here for now. So I've used it actually, it looks like quite a bit. Um, I think I realize when I get in the shower that I'm not using it at all. And so I use it every now and then, but here's that progress line from here to here. Not a lot. Um, but I will leave it in for when it gets warmer because I feel like I'm going to want to gravitate towards like strawberry pound cake more when it's warmer outside. So I will update you guys on this body scrub. This is the Sunrise Woods Creamy Body Scrub. It has been really, really good. Um, I haven't used it a ton because I really just haven't been scrubbing my body that much recently. Um, maybe it's just the cold weather making me feel like I don't need to do that, but I haven't really been doing it a lot, so I only used a little bit of it. But it's a very good scent and a very gentle scrub, so I do like it, and I do plan on getting more use out of it. I honestly didn't realize that I wasn't even using it at all, so I'm definitely gonna focus on this one a little bit more. I am gonna put in a new body scrub, and that is the Onyx Bathhouse Dim Buns Dough Foaming Body Scrub. <laughs> That's cute. That's a cute name. Uh, it's cinnamon sugar with vanilla extract, and I did already use it once, um, but I'm putting it in the project pretty much unused. Here's what it looks like. See, I scooped it out. It really smells like straight up cinnamon. Like it almost smells like a ginger snap, but I'm, I'm loving it. And this formula is amazing, so I will continue to use this and try and finish it up. Okay, for um, Fine Fragrance Mist, I did make some progress on the coconut mint drop. And for me, this is big progress, okay? For you guys, it might not be that big, but for me, it's pretty big. So here's where we started at. Here's where we went to in a month. And then the past month, I did this much. For me, that's a lot. I'm gonna keep it in the project and continue to try and use it up a lot. I've been loving this scent. It's it's so good. It's so good. I don't know why they didn't bring it back uh, this past winter, but this is from 2020. It's been so good. I'm gonna continue to try and use it. I wanna try and get like in, maybe at the top of the coconut. That would be nice. Just so I can like actually say that I've used it a lot, um, but I've really been enjoying this one. One that really hasn't been used that much, but I've been enjoying it is Whip Dream from Pink. 
and this one here is my progress in the last month about the same a little bit less maybe than previous um but it's honestly just like a super simple vanilla scent so i'm just going to continue using this one probably focusing mostly on coconut mint drop but this one every now and then and the last um body spray that i have to update you guys on is velvet sugar now i put this one in because i figured it'd be cute and topical for valentine's day but i've actually been enjoying it especially for those times where we go out. Um, Ryan and I actually just moved to like the city of Houston. I was living in a suburb earlier and we've been going out a lot more, spending a lot more money, but like going out to eat and things like that. So I don't know, it just feels more official when I put on something like this than when I put on just one of those like vanilla scents. So yeah, I've actually really been enjoying this one. I definitely got more progress on it than I did when I put it in the progress. I mean, when I put it in the project, last spring which is these little marks up here so this is the past month still not bad for me but i'm going to continue to use it see where i can get i want to get it pretty far i'd like to get it below velvet sugar i'll probably keep it in for the spring project so i'm really enjoying that one by the way i'm sorry if you can hear those like trucks outside i live right next to a usps facility and i think they're actually like moving pallets right now with like a one of those machines i don't know what that's called um a pallet jack anyways i'm gonna put in a bunch of minis <laughs> so the first mini i really am putting in a bunch of minis because i'm going on a ski trip so i'm probably only gonna pack minis for the trip but also like i have a lot of winter scents that i just want to finish off so the first one here is coconut and cream or hot cocoa and cream sorry um and this one already i've been using a ton so once i finish off the um the coconut mint drop I'm gonna focus on this one it'll only take me a few days honestly to finish it it's so good I've been really liking this scent so that one should be fun and then we have Merry Christmas ice cinnamon roll this is probably the only lotion that I'm putting in for now I'm just gonna travel with it I may not really even use it but I am gonna put it in it smells really nice it's just like a little cinnamony vanilla scent nothing crazy I'll go ahead and mark it at the top since it's unused but yeah, I will be focusing on this one and bringing it with me on a trip. And then I am putting in Love Cotton Candy Champagne. I feel like this one's going to be really good to transition into spring, um, at least for a body cream. So this one's unused. Um, once I finish Hot Cocoa and Cream, I'll move to this and put probably mixture of these two together. So that one I'm looking forward to. The next mini I'll be putting into the project is Hibiscus Paradise. This is actually the only mini shower gel that I own because I finished off all the rest of them. And um, although it's not topical, not topical, not seasonal, I will be bringing it with me to my ski trip because it's the only mini shower gel that I own. So um, it's pretty much unused. I may have used it like once or twice. So that's gonna be in the project. And then I am gonna put in my favorite scent from Pink and that is Warm and Cozy. Um, the scent notes are soft vanilla, toasted coconut, and passion fruit. It's pretty much at like halfway used. And here is the mark right here of where it's starting at. These two marks are from previous times it's been in my projects. I honestly could finish this off because it is such an amazing scent. And I actually made this much progress, like not even having it in a, in a um, project. I just like wanted to use it every now and then. And it's so good. It's it's honestly amazing. It's good for going out. It's good for staying in. It's good for just when you want to smell nice and not have to worry about it. I love this scent. Um, so I will be using this one and bringing it with me to Colorado, but I probably will just enjoy using it anyways. So that one I'm really looking forward to. So that is everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this Project Use It Up update. Let me know down below what are the scents that you're using right now. Have you gravitated towards those new spring scents from Bath & Body Works? I personally have not yet. Um, I'm not in the mood yet for spring and I'm also like not feeling like buying more body care right now. So I have not really been in stores and sniffed all the new stuff. But um, let me know down below what are you using right now. Mine primarily has been coconut mint drop, which is the same thing that I said last month, um, but also velvet sugar. Really, really loving velvet sugar right now. But yeah, that's everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe down below, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!